Okay, so for the arms, we're going to start by making a chain four. So we'll do chain one, two, three, and four. Okay, and then starting from the second chain from the hook, we are going to do single crochet um, in the next uh, two chains. Okay, so we'll do single crochet one and another single crochet and then here in the last chain over here we are going to do three single crochets uh, in the same uh, chain okay so we're going to the next chain and do a single crochet one and then do another single crochet in the same chain and another single crochet also in the same chain Okay, so this is how it's gonna look like okay and then we're going to continue on to the other side okay and in the opposite side we're going to do single crochet in the next chain and then we are going to increase in the next chain Okay, so now we have a total of eight stitches. Okay, I'm going to pick my marker and place it over here. Okay, so now in our second round, we are going to start by increasing in the next chain. So we're going to skip this little chain over here and go into the next chain. So we're going to start by increasing. Okay, and then in the next chain, we are going to do single crochets. We're going to do single crochet in the next stitch. It's a little bit tight. Okay. And then we are going to increase in the next three stitches. So we increase. one time okay so increase also in the next stitch and increase also in the next stitch okay and then in the next uh, stitch we're going to do single crochet Okay, and then in the remaining two stitches, we are going to increase in every stitch. Okay, so now in our third row, uh, we're going to start uh, by doing single crochet in the first stitch. Okay, and then we are going to increase in the next stitch. Okay, so increase. And then single crochet in the next three stitches. Single crochet one. Two and single crochet three, and then we're going to increase in the next stitch. Increase, okay, and then in the next stitch, we're going to do single crochet, then increase and do that two times. So, single crochet, then increase in the next stitch. And then repeat that one more time single crochet and increase ok 
okay and then we're going to do single crochet in the next three stitches so single crochet one two three and then increase in the last stitch okay so now in our fourth until uh, the eighth row which is the next five rows you're going to do single crochet all the way around in each row for uh, for a total of 19 stitches okay so do single crochet for the next uh, five rows and then I'll see you when you're done with the eighth row so that we start the ninth row together Okay, so now after our eighth row, this is how our arm should look like. So now in our ninth row, we're going to start by doing single crochet in the first seven stitches. So we do single crochet one, two, three, four, five, six seven okay and then we are going to decrease okay and then we do single crochet in the next stitch and then decrease again and then do single crochet in the last seven stitches so we do single crochet all the way to the end. Okay, so now in our 10th row, uh, we're going to start by doing single crochet in the first four stitches. So we'll do single crochet, one, two, three, four, okay, and then after that we are going to decrease two times, so we'll decrease. one and decrease again two okay and then we'll do single crochet in the next stitch and then we'll decrease again two times so decrease and do another decrease And then we'll do single crochet in the last four stitches so we do single crochet one two three and four okay so after we're done with that now we have a total of 13 stitches okay so now for the next nine rows which is from row 11 until row 19 we are going to do single crochet all the way around in each row for a total of 13 stitches in each row okay so please do single crochet for the next nine rows and then i'll see you when you're done with the 19th row so that we do the 20th row together okay but before you continue make sure you stuff at uh, the bottom part of the arm first and then continue with the other rows okay so after the 19th row this is how our arm should look like so now in the 20th row which is the last row we are going to decrease all the way around to the end uh, for a total of seven stitches okay so we're going to do a decrease okay and then we're going to continue decreasing 
all the way to the end. Okay, and then when you get to the last stitch, I'm just going to slip stitch and then I'll cut my yarn and leave it long enough for sewing. Okay, so uh, you can stuff this part of your uh, arm a little bit or you can just leave it like that. So in my case, I just stuffed it a little bit. Okay, so now we are going to start making the legs. Okay, so for the leg, we are going to start uh, by doing a chain 7, so I already did that. And then we are going to start with the second chain from the hook, and we are going to do 5 single crochets, or single crochet in the next 5 chains. Okay, so we are going to do single crochet, 1, 2, 3, four and five okay and then after that in the last chain we are going to do three single crochets okay so we'll do single crochet one two and three so all in the same chain Okay, and then after that, we are going to continue on to the other side. Okay, and from the other side, we are going to do single crochet in the next four chains. Okay, so we do single crochet. One. Two. And then single crochet four. Okay, and then we have one chain remaining, and in the last chain we are going to increase. Okay, so do an increase. Okay, so now we have a total of 14 stitches. Okay, so now in our second row. Uh, we're going to start by increasing in the first stitch So we're going to increase Okay, and then we're going to do single crochet in the next four stitches so we do single crochet one two Three and four okay and then we're going to increase three times so increase one time increase again in the next stitch and increase also in the next stitch Okay, and then after that, we are going to do single crochet in the next four stitches. So do single crochet, one, two, three, and four. Okay. And then in the remaining two stitches, we are going to increase two times. So you're going to increase in the next stitch and increase in the last stitch.
okay so now we have a total of 20 stitches okay so now in our third row we're going to start by doing single crochet in the first stitch okay and then we're going to increase in the next stitch okay and then we're going to do single crochet in the next five stitches so we do single crochet one two three four five okay and then we'll increase in the next stitch and then do single crochet in the next three stitches so single crochet one two and three okay and then increase in the next stitch okay and then we'll do single crochet in the next five stitches so single crochet one two three four five okay then increase in the next stitch then we do single crochet in the remaining two stitches so single crochet and single crochet okay so now we have a total of 24 stitches okay so now in our fourth row uh, we're going to start by doing single crochet in the first two stitches so we'll do single crochet and single crochet and then we'll do single crochet in the next five stitches then increase and repeat that three times so we do single crochet one two three four five and then increase and then repeat that again so five single crochet one two three four five and increase okay and repeat the third time five single crochet one two three four five and increase okay and then after that we'll do single crochet in the last uh, three stitches okay so we'll do single crochet single crochet and single crochet Okay, so now um, we're going to start in the next row which is our fifth row and in our fifth row we're going to start by doing single crochet in the first stitch so we do single crochet and then increase in the next stitch so increase and then we do single crochet in the next stitch and increase in the next stitch and then we do single crochet in the next five stitches 
So single crochet, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, and then increase in the next stitch. Okay, and then single crochet in the next stitch. And then increase in the next stitch. And single crochet in the next three stitches. So single crochet one. Two, three, and then increase in the next stitch, and single crochet in the next stitch, increase in the next stitch. And then we do single crochet in the next five stitches. So do single crochet one, two, three, four, and five. Okay, and then we we'll do single crochet uh, in the next stitch. So we do single crochet and then increase in the next stitch. Okay, so this is how it's gonna look like. Okay, so now in our sixth row, uh, we're going to do single crochet all the way around but in the back loop only. For a total of 36 stitches so we're going to go into the back loop and do single crochet single crochet okay single crochet Okay, so you're going to continue doing single crochet all the way to the end and in the back loops only. Okay, so after you're done with that, this is how it should look like. So now for the next two rows, which is row 7 and row 8, you're going to do single crochet all the way around in each row for a total of 36 stitches in each row. Okay, so please do single crochet for the next two rows and then we'll start the ninth row together. Okay, so now after the eighth row, this is how uh, our foot should look like. So now in our ninth row, we're going to start by doing single crochet in the first nine stitches. So we'll do single crochet one, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, and then after the ninth stitches, uh, we're going to decrease. Okay, so you're going to do a decrease. Okay, and then after that, we're going to do single crochet, then decrease, and repeat that five times. So we're going to do single crochet and then decrease then again single crochet decrease okay and then single crochet and decrease And then single crochet again and decrease. 
okay and then again the last time single crochet and decrease okay and then after that we're going to do single crochet in the next eight stitches so do single crochet one two three four five six seven eight and then decrease the last time okay so now we have a total of 29 stitches okay so now uh, in our 10th row we are going to start by doing single crochet in the next eight stitches so do single crochet one two three four five six seven eight okay and then uh we're going to decrease two times okay so we're going to decrease one time and decrease again the second time and then uh, we're going to do single crochet in the next three stitches so do single crochet one two three okay and then you're going to decrease two times so decrease one and decrease again the second time Okay, and then we do single crochet in the next eight stitches so single crochet one two three four five six seven eight and then decrease again one time okay okay and then now in our 11th row uh, we're going to start by doing single crochet in the first eight stitches so we do single crochet one two three four five six seven eight okay and then we are going to decrease four times so we decrease one time, decrease again the second time, okay, and then decrease again the third time. And then decrease the last time. Okay, and then after that we do single crochet in the remaining eight stitches okay so we do single crochet Okay. 
Okay, so after that now in our 12th round uh, We're going to start by doing single crochet in the first six stitches. So we we'll do single crochet one two three four five six Okay, and then we're going to decrease one time Okay, so decrease. Okay, and then we're going to do single crochet in the next four stitches. So we'll do single crochet one, two, three, and four. Okay, and then we are going to decrease again. So decrease. Okay, and then we do single crochet in the remaining six stitches. Do single crochet. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Okay, so now we have a total of uh, 18 stitches. Okay, so now uh, in our 13th row, we're going to start by doing single crochet in the first seven stitches. So we do single crochet. One, two, three, Four, five, six, seven. Okay, and then after that, we'll decrease two times. So decrease one time. And then decrease again. Okay. Okay, and then after that, we're going to do single crochet in the remaining seven stitches. Okay, so we'll do single crochet. Okay, so now we have a total of 16 stitches. Okay, so this is how our bottom foot is gonna look like. Okay, so it's like a little shoe. So after you're done with that, now for the next seven rows, which is from row 14 until row 20, you're going to do single crochet all the way around in each row for a total of 16 stitches in each row. Okay. So, and before you continue, make sure you stuff the bottom part uh, of the leg and then you continue to the next seven rows. Okay, so I'll see you when you're done with the 20th row so that we start the 21st row together. Okay, so guys, after the 20th row, this is how our leg looks like. Okay, so make sure to stuff it a little bit before we continue because this is our last row. And in the last row, we are going to decrease all the way around for a total of eight stitches. Okay, so we're going to decrease. And then decrease also. In the next stitch. Okay, so you continue decreasing all the way to the end. So when you get to the end of the row, uh, what you're gonna do is you're going to go into the next stitch 
and slip stitch and then you cut your yarn long enough for sewing as you can see this is how i cut mine okay and then after that we're going to start making the ears <laughs> 